Hello everybody, Stallions, Ansem, Jack Boy here bringing you guys a very special video on the Jacob's Vending Machine located within the uh, Zombie Island of Dr. Ned DLC. And uh, this machine is really unique um, because it's the only machine of its kind and it is basically what it, it, it implies. It's a Jacob's Vending Machine and it doesn't only have Jacob's weapons and gear it also has gear from other manufacturers which I find lame because sometimes it doesn't even have Jacob's equipment but there's some pretty good stuff sometimes in this in this bad boy machine but it also has some limitations once activated so let's get in let's get into how to activate it and just some more more on what the the uh, vending machine actually is okay dudes so the vending machine is activated through the side mission called upsell and upsell is um, only obtainable after you finish the main mission called uh, Jacob's Fodder. Now, Upsail will be at the um, Jacob's Bounty Board located within Jacob's Cove. And once you pick up the mission, it's really simple mission, guys. All you have to do is pick up this power coupling uh, right outside of town. And you take that power coupling back to the Jacob's Vending Machine, which in turn will activate it. Now, there are some limitations, though, that uh, you know come with activating this machine. And that is... Once you activate the machine, once you put the power coupling in, the machine will activate and then once you save and quit, you leave the area, come back, like leave to another place and come back, the machine will be deactivated. And I think this is a, uh, I think this is a glitch guys, I'm not really sure though, it might be a feature, it might be a glitch, um, but it is really pretty stupid in my opinion. Uh, so you only got really one chance at this machine. But there actually is a way to get two chances at the machine. So right when you put the power clooping in, the machine will activate. And don't turn in the mission, okay? If you want two chances at the machine, don't turn in the mission. So what you do, let's say you, you saved and quit, right? And you, ne you never turned in the mission. Uh, what you can do is you can come back in and then turn in the mission. And you'll get another chance at it. That's that's really all you have to do. You'll you'll get another chance. The machine will be activated. The lim The limitations are still there, though. Uh, where you, um, if you save and quit, go into another area, then the machine will deactivate. But other than that, that's, that gives you another opportunity to hit the machine up. Well, there you go, guys. The Jacob's Vending Machine. I love this machine a lot, but I wish that ridiculous uh, glitch slash feature was not there. I don't know if it's a glitch. I don't know if it's a feature. You know, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Let me know if you've gotten anything really, really beast out of this thing. As you guys saw in my gameplay, I got an equalizer. So remember, do not save this mission, though. I do not recommend, you know, saving the mission like I did and waiting till level 69, waiting till playthrough 2.5 because the items inside do not scale. So <laughs> I don't recommend doing that. Just when you get the mission, when you get the opportunity to to opportunity to do the mission I recommend doing it so anyway I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'm out of here peace